So the results of the Murano study at initial analysis have been published in the New England Journal earlier this year. So the superiority in terms of progression-free survival and higher rates of undetectable MRD for the venetoclax combination have already been established and already been published. The main emphasis uh, of the presentation here was the outcome of patients in the venetoclax rituximab arm after drug cessation. Uh, we've now got nearly 12 months median follow-up and in all patients, regardless of MRD status, uh, who stopped venetoclax at the two-year period, the likelihood of progression-free survival one year later is 87%. So it's shown that as a general treatment strategy, time-limited therapy with drug cessation is feasible and safe. There are some subsets within that and the small portion of patients who have high level MRD positivity have a high likelihood of disease relapse. Now we looked back and in those patients they were actually progressing on the venetoclax prior to cessation of therapy. For all others, either with undetectable MRD or with low level MRD, the likelihood of uh, disease control for the first year after treatment is very high.